it's funny that you edit these now uh, because I, I, when I screw up, like you see it and you're going to see it. Nobody else is going to see it, but you see it. Hey everyone, Ron Fartley back here with another Medium Monday where we take a look at a small batch maker's hot sauce and uh, talk through both the company as well as the sauce we're going to try. Today is the Bottle Rocket Hot Sauce Co. Verde. So this is a medium sauce. Got this one in Fuego box that they are in, but you can also find it on their website, uh, Bottle Rocket Hot Sauce Co. You can see here, nice little uh, bottle that is also a rocket just blasting off. And uh, you'll notice too that the labels for each of their sauces ends up with different colors. And then for the red ones, uh, they end up being different shades of red because it's hot, hotter and hottest. So we'll uh, go ahead and try this one out. I have already taken the wrapper off. You'll notice, uh, give a little click there, a metal cap. Take a smell. Get a lot of the jalapeno in this sauce just on the nose itself. And pour some out. Nice and viscous, you can see some chunks of pepper seeds here. And get a nice little pile. Go ahead and try this out. All right, so the jalapeno is very strong. Um, comes forward really nicely, nice and crisp with the vinegar that's in here. I wouldn't read through the ingredients. Green jalapenos, organic white vinegar, cucumber, organic lime juice, and salt. So you'll notice one thing that not too many people are using, and that is cucumber. So it gives a little bit of a different taste to it. If you enjoy cucumber water, um, probably gonna be a big fan of this one. The heat's fairly low, so I'm wondering if the cucumber offsets that a bit, but the play that it has with the vinegar is, is pretty nice and makes this a very mild sauce. Bottle Rocket Hot Sauce Company, created by Jay Huffman, Josie Orr, and Colin Duddy, uh, three gentlemen out of Austin, Texas. They decided to put this together, been in the game for about a year now, but really each of them coming from more of a startup background and seeing an opportunity for a different kind of hot sauce. Uh, in terms of branding, like their their brand and their website is one of the best that we've seen. So they really focused on kind of the design and the aesthetic of the, the brand itself. When you look at the label, it's got this nice matte. You've even got some of the uh, galaxy or stars in the, the background of this bottle that's just kind of blasting off. And so it's really interesting to watch kind of how they operate. They've got a big post on Medium about how they started the company and their Twitter handle and just kind of their social media in general. It's a little irreverent, but without being offensive. Now I mentioned the sauces and the labels on the sauces. You have the Verde, which is this really nice, bright, deep green. It's bright and deep together. Or, or can you do that? I'm not a hue expert by, by any means, but uh, compared to other jalapeno sauces that tend to be a little more, um, let's see, a desaturated green, for instance, this one comes off very nicely. Uh, they're hot, hotter, and hottest. Again, all shades of red. They're hottest being the most deep in that red color. The decision to do that was intentional. So again, going for more of a branding aspect and kind of a uh, how do we want to position ourselves, they decided to go with the hot, hotter, hottest because it's straightforward, it's easy to understand, and not too many people are doing it. So instead of worrying too much about names, they're going more with just saying what it is. It's hot, hotter, hottest, or in this case, Verde. You can find them at BottleRocketSauce.com on Instagram, on Twitter. The other day they were offering to uh, hear your worst take and then argue with you about it. So a fun brand and uh, pretty good mild sauce. Again, that cucumber really comes through and offsets the heat of the jalapeno pretty nicely. Thanks for watching Medium Monday. Until next time, I'm Ron Fartley.